Hey guys, I wanted to do a video today on the fakes that we can get from Trader Joe's. I live in Zone 5 in Illinois and I imagine that Trader Joe's out west or in the south probably have different fakes coming to them, but um, these are the ones that we are able to get here in the Midwest. Um, these are organic they're organic fakes, they're organic black fakes. And it's real frustrating because they never have the type of fig that it is listed um, on any of our store fig, store bought figs. And so I wanted to impress upon you the deliciousness of these ones from Trader Joe's. Um, so these are their organic black fakes. I got them I would say it's probably, it's a pound, but it felt heavier. Um, I got these for about five something. Let's just say they were, you know, 550. Uh, um, and as you can see, it's, well, it's August 12th. So <laughs> they got these back in end of July. Um, I cut them up and I wanted to show you because these are not typical. I've tried all our figs that uh, from stores and they're typically, you know, black mission figs or what. These are very different than anything I've ever tasted. And I'm a new figster. I've got my own trees grown, but they're all first years and I haven't tasted any figs off of any of them. I've got about 40 varieties uh, growing in the backyard right now and the best ones out there and so this reminded me of some of the uh, tastings that I've seen online on YouTube and so I wanted to share with you guys if you're looking for a super rich full body flavored fig like they talk about for example you know the black Madeiras etc etc um I don't know what this is, but I got to tell you, it's coming really close to some of the ways that people on YouTube describe the real good figs. I mean, look at it. It looks incredibly jammy and thick or dense, and it was. And it does have a type of like a cherry syrup flavor. Uh, the skin is, the skin is like thin and you can peel it away. You know, very typical of like a black mission or a brown turkey, but it sure doesn't taste like them. I mean, it tastes really different and if anyone out there knows what this is or can identify it as you can see there's a squat shape there's a an ob like a teardrop shape round there they seem to come in all different shapes but the flavor is incredible the jamminess is sensational it's very sweet um, there is a seed crunch in there and because these are so delicious and organic, I'm going to guess they're at about like 20 to 30 gram range, uh, but they're all in different sizes as well. And so I would say the average is between 20 and 30. Um, but look at that. I'm so happy. I am so happy that I finally got to try something that resembles the ones that are being tasted by figsters on YouTube that have the really great quality ones growing in their yard. Very exciting. And so if anyone can identify these, um, Trader Joe's is getting them from Monrovia, California. And I know Monrovia is a, you know, sells, uh, fig plants as well like they sell their mission they sell corkies they sell chicago hardy um i don't know what else they sell but i think they sell all kinds 
And I don't, I can't, I don't know what this is, but I wish someone would tell me it's delicious, but you know what? I nabbed their seeds and they fell to the bottom immediately. And we're gonna do same thing right now. So I'm just grabbing some. try and grow these. I don't know what kind of thing it is. We'll leave that in there. And then the second set of dark figs is this one. And these look like brown turkey to me. Um, but they taste, I don't know, they taste good to me like i got brown turkey from one of our grocery stores the other day and they don't taste like this these have a unique flavor the ones from trader joe's and you know i've always taken for granted how figs taste now i'm really now that i'm a figster i'm really sort of paying attention to the flavor and maybe that's why but um i got some from jewel Osco, our grocery store out here the other day that were brown turkeys that I believe to be brown turkeys and they really had such a bland flavor and um, I mean if you pick the ripe one it was sweet but that was about it you just tasted sweetness and that was it but these from Trader Joe's if they're brown turkey I don't know but they taste and feel like you're biting into a peach. And so this is what they look like. They are glistening. They do have a bit of a cavity. These have to be in the, you know, high 40s to 50 gram range. They're larger, but there are some smaller ones in the container, which may be 30 grams, but they're all larger size. And that's another reason why I think it might be brown turkey. But again, if any of you can tell, they bite like a peach, like a beautifully ripened, you know, juicy peach. And then they t have a flavor of, of something refreshing and light. And they are very good. It's not like you're going you're gonna eat this one and it's so rich. It coats your mouth and it stays with you. Um, and it is like a bomb of richness. And then you have one of these, and it's just as good in a sense of, you know, um, in the sense of the flavor is there. There's a beautiful flavor and a refreshing to it so it's sort of like you know cleanses your palate if if you will you know with this you you'll want to drink water after it it's so rich and I just wanted to give a plug to Trader Joe's for having something that we figsters like especially if you're new to figging you know something to to you know have as you await, eagerly await your fig trees coming to fruition. And so if you want me to do a taste, I'll do it at, now at the end. So if you guys don't want to wait through it or listen through it, you don't have to. But okay, here's the first one. This is the organic black fig. Slight seed crunch, very jammy. It's got a berry flavor, maybe a like a a deeper berry flavor, like a cherry, cherry syrup. Um, coats your mouth. It's really sweet. I mean, it's the highest sweetness I can give it. Very delicious. And then this one, which I believe is a brown turkey. It's 
I don't know if it's because it's bigger, but it, um, I'm crunching fewer seeds in this one when you might think, you know, opposite, but it might be because of the volume of it. But I crunched hardly any seeds in that one. There are, but not as many. And uh, again, refreshing. Figgy. Slight berry, um, but refreshing like a peach. Biting into a peach, very similar. Uh, anyway, I hope you liked this video. Thanks for watching.